Hi Gemini, it's Elle here to do your June 2018 reading. This is a general reading. It will not resonate with every Gemini. Um, check your rising moon, Venus, whatever sign you feel like is best to check for you. Um, if it does resonate with you, please like, share, comment, subscribe to the channel. Thank you to those who have. I'll save the announcements to the end. I have shuffled and prayed over the cards. Let's go ahead and get started. Thank you for the general messages for Gemini for June 2018. Messages of love and light, messages of truth and clarity. I'm going to do a five card advice spread. The first card is right is you, Gemini, where you are. The second card is are you in your correct path? The third card is your main obstacle. The fourth card is what's helping you. The fifth card is how can progress be made? Okay, two wanted to come out. How can progress be made here? Bottom of the deck, the nine of water. So it looks like some of my Geminis are having wish fulfillment. Um, this could be a Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. Maybe they, they uh, someone of that star sign has something to do with your wish fulfillment. It doesn't have to be that. It's just that whatever you set your intentions on is now being manifest in your life wish fulfillment this is you right where you are Ooh, ten of air so some of you are dealing with an ending due to betrayal being back backstabbed blindsided mentally just done you know you can you the mental anguish the heartbreak heartache it, it can get no higher than this. This is the end. Are you in your correct path? Ace of water. Nice. This says there'll be a resurgence of love in a situation. Maybe with a Cancer Pisces Scorpio. Doesn't have to be. Or this is a resurgence of love for self. I'm feeling like with this ending here. This betrayal. This is someone who takes their cup back so that they can find themselves again and find their sanity this could be new love or new friendship but this could be the resurgence of an old situation even you know after betrayal I mean it could be so many things what is your main obstacle the seven of water having to choose choices having a lot of choices to make having a lot of cho choices to having a lot of options to choose from this could be someone who gets a lot of attention this could be cancer pisces scorpio someone creating illusions around you and trying to disillusion a situation this could be a cheating spouse or boyfriend or girlfriend someone who makes promises just to break them what is helping you messenger of air you confronting the situation head on you're looking that way um you confronting the confusion you're confronting the illusion you want the truth the messenger of air or the knight of air or the knight of uh knight of swords rushes in and it's confrontational it is confrontational but they give their truth you know and they, and they're seeking the truth they give their truth by way of seeking the truth they give a message of if this is what I know, this is what I thought about. It's confrontational, but a lot of you are confronting 
a situation that's based in falsehood, you're confronting it head on. Like this love is fake. This love isn't real. Or this isn't how love is supposed to be. I think that's what you, some of you are confronting or confronting someone about. How can progress be made? The tower, the king of fire. Progress can be made by the universe coming in and helping you out, giving you a, a leg up by breaking down a foundation that you thought was just so sturdy, was so great. Now you're going to see that maybe a fire sign, Aries, Sagittarius, Leo, Sun, Moon, or Rising. You're going to get some clarity within dealing with this person. King of Air. Six of Swords. That just fell out of the deck. Some of you are dealing with another air sign. They betrayed you. Um, or maybe there was there's some tough times. But it looks like you guys are trying to move forward. Water signs, it looks like it's tough energy here. If you're dealing with water sign, this could be you coming up as the king of air, Gemini. You could um, very well be trying to move away from turbulent times. Yeah, five of fire. Move away from just the arguing. Also, some of you want to get clear within yourself, the hermit card going within to figure out how to deal with this five of water and then the world yeah you're just gonna grieve the loss of it's like some of you found out that maybe there was a third party there was interference and you might be putting an end to this entire situation messenger of water Messenger of Fire, Page of Fire. Yeah, some of you are just leaving a situation. Hierophant. You're going to get some, some clarity. Somebody's going to come rushing in and telling you two of air. Three of water. Yeah. Three of earth. Somebody's going to tell you or something... Right here, you're seeking and finding. You want information and you're going to find it out. And it's it causes you to take action to preserve yourself. Because I think you've given away who you are too, too long and too much. It's like you thought you wanted a situation, but... It's just burdensome. Let's see if we can get more messages for another set of Geminis. Thank you for the messages for Gemini. True. Accurate messages. bottom of the deck the page of wands yeah you're getting you're getting a message either from a reliable friend an adult child something that calls you to take action you know um yeah calls you to move this is you right where you are nine of pentacles some of you are single waiting for partnership not desperate But definitely ready to be in a loving, lasting, stable relationship with the Nine of Pentacles. This is, are you on your right path? For some of you, the answer might be yes, Six of Swords. You've moved away from conflict, drama, turbulence, trying times. A struggle. You found balance in moving away. 
peace and serenity what is your main obstacle it looks like you were carrying a some of you were carrying a situation a relationship you just kept carrying it and it had been done it had been expired it was long expired it was long over but you just kept carrying it because you felt like if I just if I just keep up and this could be with a fire sign Aries Sagittarius Leo Sun Moon Rising if I just keep carrying this situation maybe it will change maybe it will turn to the ace of wands we'll have a new passionate start I don't know this is your main obstacle you just keep carrying a burden a, a burdensome situation what's helping you the chariot could be a cancer or this could be this the um the message that you need to get in control of yourself get in control of your environment your atmosphere and you need to move forward for yourself you need to do some things for yourself you keep trying to incorporate another person another party a set of friends and you're forgetting about self because that's who matters most there you're trying to find balance here, the message is you find balance by putting yourself first. You can't be anything great for anyone else if you can't even be great for yourself. The chariot carries one. Positive movement forward for yourself. How many times did I say so? How can progress be made? Five of Pentacles. You might have to subtract yourself from a situation. Or subtract someone else from your situation, your life. Leave someone else out in the cold. Capricorn, Virgo, Taurus. Leave a situation right where it is. What is the chariot? Four, yeah, four of pentacles on the chair. You're trying to hold on to some status quo, some type of situation that no longer serves you. You could be trying to hold on to a cancer person. Um, you need to let go. The four of pentacles and then the five of pentacles. It says cut this situation out cut this person out it's a burden you keep trying to hold on to a situation that no longer serves you um, you hold on to it because from the outside looking in it looks good to other people nine of Pentacles to ten of sword once again ten of sword ten of wands it's burdensome this person has betrayed you more than one time more than twice more than three times and you keep hanging in there because you feel like whatever the situation gives you you feel like that is enough to live by but it what this is doing to you is making you a miserable person some of you are choosing to stay in situations because of what the other person can do for you or what they do for you or being, being aligned with them aligns you with you fill in the blank but you're miserable on the inside there is no respect yeah the lovers then here it comes you you need to, you need to make a choice to cut this situation out cut this person out subtract yourself what is the Ten of Wands? The King of Wands could be an Aries, Sagittarius, Leo, Sun Moon Rising. It's burdensome dealing with this person. It's nothing but problems. They think they know everything. They want to be in charge of everything, but don't want to do the real work. 
six of one what did i just say you find victory you find balance you find promotion you find feeling good about yourself you find getting attention for yourself positive attention for yourself when you walk away six of swords this could be someone you know six or more years someone you have children with someone who could be older than you or vice versa someone who you felt like as a soulmate but time <laughs> People try to base situations off of should I stay because I've known them for this amount of time and we've been dealing for this amount of time. Um, time is not an indicator of, you know, of staying in the situation or loyalty. Time, time don't give you time, you know. what are you getting in exchange for your time and your loyalty nothing let's get you some advice cards four advice cards for Gemini four advice cards for Gemini uh, for those concerned about money you're at the nine of pentacles so money is good money is stable be true to you yeah, and then I don't think you guys are doing that. You're just being true to a situation that you think serves you because you're, you know, you're scared of walking away and what walking away looks like. End of an era. We've got two endings here. And one and the last one. End of an era. It, it lasted as long as it possibly could. Let go. Walk away. Forgiveness. Yeah. You guys can't forgive because you're still in a situation. And you're still allowing it to happen to you. Whatever is happening. Whether there's a person in and out. They, you know, treat you like anything. You have support. And some of you at the five of pentacles. You feel like you don't have support. You have support. For some of you, new career. Nice. Gemini requests a personal reading. So we can pull the energy for you. We can recognize blocks going on in your situation. Um, the best approach is some real advice, some real help, some real clarity. Move forward. Make great decisions for yourself. And, um, yeah. So all of my information is below. The website is still down because I need to work on online bookings. Um... Just send me an email if you would like to request a personal reading. Okay? And we'll do it that way. Uh, take advantage of the $20 special. Okay. Alright. So, Gemini, I'm praying for you. Pray for me as well. Remember to stay in prayer. Alright? Take care. See you in mid-June.